I'm currently reading a book. I am about halfway. It is so agonizingly boring and it reads as if it was an essay. I hate it and it got better for a second but now it's just it's so bad again. I know I should put the book down. I should get rid of the book but I'm just I'm gonna keep reading this book. I'm going to waste my weekend powering through this book because I do this to myself. Today I'm going to be telling you guys why I cannot put a book down, why I always have to finish reading it. I'm hoping that when I watch this video myself later on I will see the odd reasons why I always read these books and I will see how dumb and stupid that is and maybe it will help me with the putting down of books and not finishing them all the time if they suck because why waste my time? I need help. For starters, I tell myself that I think if I push through that the book can get better. It will improve and I will enjoy it. A lot of books that I've highly enjoyed in the past have started off so slow but they got better over time. That's what I thought would happen with this book and while it did get slightly better it got worse later on so if I were to stop reading a book and the book did eventually get better then I would have missed out on that and that's just what I tell myself. Another thing is that I've invested time into this book whether it's an hour or more or less. I've put time into that book, that time that I cannot get back and I don't want that time to be wasted so I might as well finish the book. And if we're being honest that unread book does not count towards my Goodreads challenge which is something that I care about which is stupid but it, I want to get credit for the book that I'm reading. So because I've put in this amount of time into reading this book I just tell myself that I might as well just finish the damn book anyway because uh, why not? Another thing is that I like finishing what I start. If I start a book and I don't finish it, it will sit on my shelf or on my bedside table and it will haunt me. It will haunt my soul and it will eat away at my thoughts and it will just be at the back of my head for the rest of eternity until I finish the book. Yes. I am nosy. I am a nosy person. That's bad. I'm sorry, but I am. And because of that, I have to know what happens at the end of the book. If I don't know what happens at the end of the book, then it... No! I need to know what happens. I have to know. What if someone dies? What if someone hooks up with someone? What if someone goes on an incredible adventure? What if someone gets magical powers? I don't know. I need to know what happens. More likely than not, I have spent money on the book that I'm reading. And if I don't like the book that I spent money on, I am going to not only be mad, but I will force myself to read the book because I spent money on it. Money that I earned with labor and long hours of making people coffee. I wish money grew on trees, but it doesn't. It does not, so I have to finish reading the book. And if I didn't spend money on the book, then the book was a gift and someone bought it for me. This book was a gift for my best friend, but I specifically asked for it, and now I regret asking for it. My friend knows that I'm not enjoying this book. They forgive me, but I am still gonna finish reading it because I'm guilty for making them buy this book for me. That was probably almost $30 for something this atrocious. And the last reason why I think I can't can't put a book down is because I'm not sure if it's the book or if it's me. It could be a really good book, but it's just not for me. It's not my cup of tea. But even if the book isn't for me, I'll still want to push through and read it because I could recommend that book to someone that I think would like it, even though it wasn't for me. I don't know if that makes sense. <laughs> and that is why I cannot ever put a book down. Are any of you like this at all? I know a lot of people DNF books easily and they get rid of them and they sell them or they throw them away or donate them or whatever. I wish I could do that. I wish I could so badly, but I can't. So I'm gonna go now and I'm gonna go read this book. <laughs> no, I don't want to.